Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The other feature that's available to you is the Microsoft Office Assistant. This is the small animated graphic that pops up with a balloon of potential help topics associated with it. The Office Assistant will give you tips on using Excel and will handle help questions. Click on the Office Assistant to prompt him to ask if you need help. Fill in the little white text box with your question and then click search. The Office Assistant will then display a list of possible related subjects with little blue bullets next to them. You can click on the one that most closely relates to the topic that you want to look up. The help topic will display in a new window which you'll need to close when you're finished with it. Now if you would like to continue looking up help topics, or if you need to view more help topics because this wasn't the answer that you wanted, simply click the Show button at the far left of the actual Help toolbar in the Help window. This displays the Contents, Answer Wizard, and Index. Here you can also seek additional assistance. This dialog box has three tabs on it. On the Contents tab, you'll see a list of the general topics that you can read more about to gain insight into that particular function in Excel. If you see a subject you'd like to know more about, double-clicking the entry will show either the information you requested or a listing of more specific subtopics. Clicking the Answer Wizard page will provide you with a screen much like the Office Assistant's question prompt. You can simply type in the question you want to find additional information on in the box at the top and then click the search button. So notice we actually have a few more options here than you would see by even asking the Office Assistant. On the index page, you'll see an alphabetical index of available help topics. You use the first box on this screen to type in the name of the function that you're interested in acquiring information about. You can then select a keyword from box number two and then click search to look for related topics, which then you can double click to display in the pane at the right. And once you're done, you can print the topics using the print button in the toolbar and then use the X in the upper right corner to close that window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.